So if you're like most people, sometime out of the year, you're going to get a cold. You're going to get the flu. You may get an infection. Um, you might catch a virus. <clears throat> and I found a natural antibiotic that I think will be just wonderful for all of you to take that has a plethora of amazing benefits and that would be oregano oil now I'm taking oregano oil as part of my natural treatment um, against the stomach uh, problem that I've been having because of the fact that I think that I have an infection um, C. diff and oregano oil is part of my treatment that I've been using to help give me relief now Oregano oil <clears throat> is derived from the leaves and flowers of oregano, which is a hardy, bushy, perennial herb, and it's a member of the mint family. It is native to Europe, although it grows in many areas of the world. Uh, the plant can be up to 35 inches high with dark green leaves that are 2 to 3 centimeters long. The ancient Greeks and Romans used oregano and its oil for many of the health benefits that it possesses. Um, there's over 40 oregano species, but the most therapeutically beneficial is the oil produced from wild oregano or oregano vulgare that's native to Mediterranean regions. Um, but there's all kinds of really awesome uh, uses of oregano oil. Um, according to the Mercola.com website, he lists some of these. Some of the uses can be to treat foot or nail fungus. Um, you can put a few teaspoons of oregano oil in a basin of water and soak your feet in it. You can also dilute the oil, mix a drop with a teaspoon of olive or coconut oil, and then apply it on your nails or skin. It can be used to kill parasites and infections. You can dilute the oil, uh, mix a drop with a drop of carrier oil, such as coconut oil, and place it under your tongue. Hold it there for a few minutes and then rinse it out. Repeat this at least four times a day. And you can also use it to alleviate sinus infections and colds. Put a few drops of oregano oil in a pot of steaming water and then inhale the steam. Um, some of the um, components of oregano oil that make it therapeutic and healing are thymol, which is a natural fungicide with antiseptic properties. It will help boost your immune system, it will work as a shield against toxins and even help prevent tissue damage and encourages healing. And the more well-known um, ingredient <clears throat> in oregano oil is carvacrol, which is found to be effective against various bacterial infections such as Candida, Staph, E. coli, Campylobacter, Salmonella, um, and just a whole bunch of other bacteria that so many people are plagued by. This can actually help kill those bacteria. Um, other helpful compounds in Reagan oil include terpenes, which are known for their powerful antibacterial properties, rosmarinic acid, um, Narogen, which inhibits the growth of cancer cells and helps boost the antioxidants in oregano oil. Um, beta carophyllin inhibits inflammation. <clears throat> and then there's some nutrients in oregano oil too, like vitamin A, C, calcium, magnesium, zinc, iron, potassium, manganese, copper, boron, and niacin. Um, some of the benefits of using oregano oil has been to <clears throat> treat urinary tract infections, respiratory infections, yeast infections, parasitic infections, and even MRSA infections have been shown to be destroyed by um, oregano oil. Uh, oregano oil also apparently seems to... <clears throat> treat the H. pylori infection which can cause like stomach ulcers and things like that. So it's a very powerful natural antibiotic um, and there's different brands 
Probably the best brand that you could buy that I am aware of is the North American um, Herb. And I think that's the P73 oregano oil, which is the most potent. Um, but anyways, uh, it's definitely something that you should add to your kitchen, you know, your medicine cabinet. Because like I say, um, a lot of the antibiotics that doctors will prescribe you, the bacteria in your body can become resistant to them. And so they aren't as effective anymore because we got super bugs and we're taking antibiotics in from a lot of the foods that we eat, like the meat and the dairy products. And so it's making us resistant to these antibiotics, our bacteria. So natural antibiotics, though, are much more powerful, potent, and synergistic in such a way that it's harder for our bacteria, right, to become resistant to them because they're a lot more complex. And our bacteria in our gut are not used to these different, you know, complex, powerful antibacterials that are found in natural foods and stuff. So, the other positive thing is that a lot of the time these don't have as bad of side effects as, you know, synthetic antibiotics. But nevertheless, you should also treat these things as antibiotics. And that means that if you're going to use them for a long time, like more than two weeks, you really should be um, supplementing with probiotics. It's a good probiotic supplement. Um, a good brand that I like is Udo. Um, He's got a really good um, adult formulation of probiotics and just drinking kefir, yogurt. But you want to make sure you get the plain kind and you have to make sure that it has live and active cultures. Because a lot of times the yogurts are just full of sugar, you know, and stuff, which kind of defeats the whole point. And also they pasteurize it so it kills off those good bacteria. And the most preferred form of um, yogurt and kefir would be made from raw milk so that you have raw kefir, raw yogurt, and you can make those using milk kefirs, which you can buy online. Um, but other than that, you got kimchi, you got sauerkraut, but it's really a good idea to be supplementing with probiotics to put those good bacteria back in because oregano oil has been shown to kill both the bad and the good bacteria. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, and like I said, I think that I have C. diff. Now I'm going to be going to be getting a test done, hopefully soon, uh, to finally diagnose to find out if I actually do have that. But like I said, I'm treating this naturally with oregano oil and some other things that I haven't made a video on yet. But oregano oil does seem to be pretty powerful stuff. And uh, I don't even have the most potent brand. Um, the brand that I bought off iHerb is Vitality Works, and uh, I can put a link to this in the description box along with the North American Herb Oregano Oil, but definitely some powerful natural medicine that I think everybody should have in their medicine cabinet. So with that, take care, have a great day, and like this video.